In what way does your media product use, develop or challenge forms and conventions of real media products? Our media product comes under the horror genre. This genre has many different forms and conventions such as serial killers, hauntings, ghost gore and demons. Our film used some of these conventions such as serial killers and gore. Our film could be seen to come under two different subgenres. The first of these genres would be a slasher film. This is a type of horror film usually involving a psychopathic killer killing a sequence of victims in a violent manner. This can overlap into the crime subgenre which our film does. Examples of slasher films would be Friday the 13th and the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. The second subgenre of our film is found for its camera work and documentary style. This is the main subgenre our film complies to. The use of handheld camera work creates a realistic feel to the film. This would then create more audience involvement. Examples of this are The Blair Witch Project, which we took our main inspiration from, Quarantine and Cloverfield. The setting of our film also complies to conventions of horror films. As we use an abandoned church, our film abides by the convention that horror films are isolated. But our film challenges the conventions of horror films being set at night time by being set in the day. The font we used also complies to the conventions of the horror genre. The font Die 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 complies as it creates a very eerie feel to the film. The inspiration for this font is from Seven. Finally, I believe our film used, developed and challenged the form and conventions of real media products.